What's going on, you guys? Kid behind the camera here. Bridget was here. Right there. Bridget sounds sick or something today. What is going on? Hang on. Bridget was here. Something going on with you. Bridget was here. The fuck? Come on, try it. Bridget was here. Okay. Bridget, what's going on? Uh, I don't, I don't know. I'm about to cry. She's really freaking out. Get over here. Come on. Try it. So just keep trying. Bridget was here. Bridget was here. That sounded all right. That sounded real bad. Something's wrong. Bridget was here. Mm -mm. Bridget was here. That sounded good. I'm back. No? No, I didn't. Are you like sick? What's going on? No. What is wrong with my voice? I don't know, dude. It sounds rough. Maybe I should go to the doctors. I think you need to go to the doctors like right now. Really? Like the hospital? Yes. There's something wrong with you, Bridget. I'm just messing with Bridget. You sounded fine. God, I'm just trying to. Hey, you scared me with a freaking clown yesterday. I can't tell you sound off. Yeah, but you shouldn't scare me with my health. Anyway, you made me think I was gonna die. <laughs> Look, Dude, today, scream. stop. Scream. We're not listening to the scream again. One more time. <laughs> I'm tired of it, okay? I'm embarrassed. <laughs> today is Saturday. If you didn't see the video we uploaded yesterday, that was part of it. They scared me with a clown. Guys, now let's get the Saturday started. It's so funny. Damn, Bridget, what's going on with you? You look different. I'm sorry. Look at this bird. She feels just sitting in your area. Oh, that's adorable. At least she's not running from the camera. That's a that's a new thing. I know. How you doing, Felix? You should have named him Garfield. I wish I would have named him Cheddar. Hey, Cheddar. He's <laughs> <laughs> Claude's like, don't take the attention from me. Aww. Well, right now, Bridget's taking me over to Grandpa's house because he wants to, I don't know, really know what the plan is. Like, I think he wants to go yard sailing. It's early Saturday morning right now, and he wants to chill, and he refuses, absolutely refuses to come pick me up. So Bridget has to take me, and he says you can't come. What if I want to come? He's not allowing it. His foot's down on this. I'm coming. Bridge is coming, Grandpa. No, I'm not. I'm just kidding. I don't want to go. <laughs> oh, just say you hate me. <laughs> I just, I'd rather do other shit. We got to get Dad to my house by any means necessary. Oh, my gosh. I thought of a really good idea how to get him here. You're, like, screaming at me. You can talk to me, you know. I thought of a really we'll good... Be, we'll be back. So I'm sitting here riding around with Grandpa. Uh, I can't talk, can I? No, you can't. I'm sitting here riding around with Grandpa. Drinking? Nothing. I'm doing something. It's just too early. Your words are slurring. <laughs> yeah. I was walking while I went grandpa. So yeah, I'm here, sitting here riding around with grandpa, chilling. He's sitting there looking for yard sales and whatever else he can do. It's Saturday morning, man. Gotta do something. I ain't gonna stay home. So, we gotta talk about Doug. What about Doug? He seems to think he is unprankable. I am unprankable. Not you, Doug. Oh, he's unprankable. And you are prankable. I've gotten you so many times, that's not even worth talking about. Hey, the cloud was the best. That guy, hey, can't talk that. That got me, I shit my fucking pants. But, you know, Doug, I was at his house yesterday and he's like, I ain't worried about y'all pranking me. Well, he knows everything anyway. And that got under my skin. We need to get his ass. How? I don't know, that's the question, dude. How do you get Doug? I don't know. Like, I, I don't know enough about the guy. <laughs> I mean, so one of the questions that we get a lot is do we still have our P.O. box? And we're, we're yeah. checking it now. Well, we stopped doing the mailbag videos. So the reason, and I don't know if a lot of people know this, the reason we stopped doing mailbag videos is because people were sending money. And we, you know, we, we appreciate that you thought that you could send it to us, but we, we don't want you guys to send your money to us. But we still do read your letters because people do still send letters. So let's check out, see if we got any letters today. Two. 
How about a little impromptu fan mail? Let's open it. Let's see what we're dealing with. My name is Jojo. I am from Tennessee. My parents got divorced when I was six months old. My dad very rarely makes an effort to see me. That's that's bad. That's bad. You should see. Even thought of my mom, even though my mom has a boyfriend, it's not the same. When I watch her videos, it helps me feel the same. It makes me feel better. When I'm depressed, they go, they, they make me laugh. Happy 66th birthday, GP. Your videos always make me laugh. I feel like I'm part of your family every time I watch them. I hope to have a great, I hope you have a great birthday. Hi, Michael and Bridget. Hello. You're young and sad. <laughs> yeah, damn pants fell down again. That's you, all right. That's me. So here's a little piece of video history. Right here is the gas station Grandpa left me in when I was in the dress. And you don't come there, you're right. And right here, across the street, is the gas station you dropped me off at when I told you there was a nuclear bomb. <laughs> well, you shouldn't have lied. <laughs> I thought it was going to blow up the world. But I thought you were unprankable. I am. So, yes, nuclear bomb prank right there. Dropped me off in the dress right there. I gotta get you again, man. You can get me. I'm ready for you now. See, that's the problem. You know, you just can't be pranked, man. I don't even think I'm gonna try this year. So here's a question, Pop. The fair. Don't bring that up again. What? I ain't been to the fair in 20 something years. Well, come on, let's talk about it. You were a little boy then, you got arrested. Yeah, I spit off the sky lift. You spit off the sky lift and, got, and I ain't been back to the fair since. I ruined the fair for you? You ruined the fair, man. I had to leave early. I was ready to eat some more food. I want you to go to the fair. I'm not going. Why? Because I don't want to go. The fair's going to be here next week. Good. Let it come and go. You ain't getting my money. Come to the fair. I'm not going to the fair! What? Now get over it! Well, I just got back from hanging out with Grandpa, and I really want him to go to the fair. Really really want grandpa to go to the coastal carolina fair i don't care how much he yells he'll have a good time when he's there he just refuses to go but if you want me to prank him and force him to go to the fair click the like button smack the like button as many times as you can and i will go it's gonna have to be enough to justify when we're in the parking lot of the fair that he stays so click like and we will force him to go to the fair so hanging out with grandpa i got some acid reflux going <laughs> It's just what happens. I hang out with him and I just... Yeah, it's like it. contagious or something. So we don't have any acid reflux pills. So Bridget is telling me <laughs> to use... Lemon juice. So what do I do? You squirt some of that in the cup. How much? That's good. Okay, I'm about to say, because you don't fuck with me. <laughs> and then you put water in it. Sugar? No. So it's not lemonade? Just, just water. Which one's water? The first one. No. And that's it? Yeah, and you drink it. And, and why? It works. And it works for me. Why? I, don't, I honest to God don't know where I got this from. I just know that two acids make alkaline, so that's why I do it, and it works. You better hope you're right, because people are gonna fact check you in the comments. I'm pretty sure I'm right. In fact, I'm gonna Google it now. Okay. Mom, will, will you Google it? Yeah. Because I swear it takes away my acid reflux. So today is Cindy's birthday. Happy birthday! Happy Mom. birthday, Cindy! This is what I got you for your birthday. Oh, Michael, you're the best. I know. Thank you. Is, it, is, it, cool. is it what you always wanted? It is. A skin flap that's made out of a real person. Thanks, guys. Let me know when you're going to put the mask on. <laughs> oh, she is? So this is Cindy. Oh. You oh, you, you want to flip it so you can see yourself? Oh. <laughs> you just wear it to dinner tonight and like tell nobody, like, what are you talking about? What's under that? What's under that mask? Surprise! Remove that mask. <laughs> so something that I noticed in yesterday's vlog, Bridget, yes. We have yet, we have yet to bring the generator in the house from the hurricane. Oh my gosh, Michael, we should try to move this to like the garage. That means I'm gonna have to do manual labor. Let's just get something to cover it up with. Why, yeah, why don't we move it over there? 
Ow! Hell no. Michael, please move it over there. I can't even budge it. Michael! Don't drag it! I'm not doing... What are you looking up? Oh, cool. I like that. I'm trying to decide what my first process is going to be at Olive Garden today. Okay, so that's a cool one. Parpa Deli pasta. What's it called? I don't know, like Parpa Deli or something. With traditional meat sauce. And I'm thinking meatballs. My first pasta is definitely going to be like Alfredo with uh, that fried chicken. Look at this pasta noodle. Damn. They're kind of like thick, flappy noodles. Holy crap, maybe I'll get that. Let's see here. What is cavatappi? I think that might be those like little curvical curves. Yeah, I think those are like the um, screw noodles. Yeah, okay, I don't know those. So I'm thinking I'm gonna get the proper deli, meat sauce, and meatballs. Nice. Well, we were trying to figure out what kind of pasta we're getting, Cindy. Oh yeah? Mom, are you gonna get never ending pasta too? Yeah. How do you go to Olive Garden? Hey! <laughs> you. Hey, what? <laughs> You're just a family looking at the menu? <laughs> There's nothing funny about that. I'm hungry. Aww. Yes, whenever I go to Olive Garden for never ending pasta, I pre look up all the options so I know what I'm getting beforehand. That noodle, I think, Big is deal. new. Big deal. It might, it looks new. I might get it though. That's what I, you, I don't hey, want to talk about food. That would be so good with meatballs. I don't want to, yes, of course it would. I don't want to talk about food. Yeah, I'm a little bit of fun, Clyde, with the little doggy. That's our other dog. He's so cute. Clyde carries him around in his mouth like that. They're friends. Oh my gosh, he's hoping Bella won't get it. Oh, maybe he's like setting them up for something here. Okay, you guys. <laughs> Clyde. He's like, that's my English bulldog friend. He's so cute. Give me that doggy, Clyde. There you go. Oh. Well, that's gonna be it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Remember, click like if you want Grandpa to go to the fair, and I'm gonna make him go today. Oh my God, I'm so excited for the fair. They have the best food. I'm more excited for a different kind of food, because tonight we're going to Olive Garden, and they got never-ending pasta back. That's the only thing I wait for, but that's Aww. gonna be in tomorrow's vlog. It's the only thing Michael lives for. Literally. It's like, all the other days you walk around in a depression. I'm like, is it never any pasta yet? Aww. It's here. And no, they're not sponsoring anything. They're not I just love the restaurant. So anyway, <laughs> I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching, you guys. Like. Subscribe. Favorite. Follow on everything for to us. And let's go get some pasta. Wait. Nope, it's what is your first pasta? Uh, I always get spaghetti and meatballs. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm They gonna... don't care about this. Oh. They don't care. Thank you.